Gotti Schwartz is in Reading, Pennsylvania. Gotti, I'll start with you. Uh, I know you've been talking to students at Governor Mifflin High School there. What are those students telling you? Uh, yeah, Craig, well, this school is a total bright spot when it comes to getting students uh, out to vote and getting them registered to vote. In fact, this right here is an award they are very proud of. Uh, they got this for registering 90% of eligible seniors to vote. Uh, so those kids are very excited about their first elections. Uh, and one of their tricks here, they said, it was pretty easy. What they did was they had the kids go around and talk to other kids. They were the ones that were doing the registering, cutting out uh, the adults. And some of those kids, weren't even that engaged in politics. They just wanted their voices heard. So we talked to a classroom full of those first time voters and we found all kinds of enthusiasm. Take a listen. Quick show of hands. How many of you guys are voting in the midterms? If you guys had to summarize with one word, what are your fears? What would it be? The environment. Polarization of the country. Gun rights. I would say ignorance. Human rights. Resources. I would say immigration. Totalitarianism. Unjustice. Corruption. What would be one thing that you hope for when you go out to vote? Change. A representation. Equality. Economy. Setting an example for the future generations. Having a voice. Do you think that the two-party system adequately uh, represents your views? You know, the two-party system is kind of too set in stone. Like, I really care about the environment, but I'm a registered Republican. You can't really be in the middle because if you say that you're in the middle from both sides, you get hated for. Do you think the older generations take you guys seriously? No. No? no. I don't want to show them that we do mean business and we do take our future seriously because, I mean, I do taking their future seriously. As you can see, a lot of those students kind of reflected what we've seen all across the country, that Gen Z and millennials, uh, the ones that we've spoken to, they don't really like to be labeled. They don't like to be categorized. They don't like to be put into a box. They like to uh, think their own mind. And now it's gonna be up to them to actually show up to the polls. And, and when you look at some issues like gun rights, so here in Pennsylvania, that was one of the things that we talked to them about them. Even on an issue like that, where everybody assumes that they all have uh, somewhat of the same mind, uh, we found some differences. We're going to talk about that coming up. All right. Craig, Thank you so much. Got a Schwartz there in Pennsylvania. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.